BC Adewale is my name, your family coach. Thank you for joining me in this important video today. I will be talking about six important people in marriage. These important people that I want to mention, I want to mention you must manage them wisely, carefully. If you don't manage them carefully, it may hurt your marriage very badly and number one person in marriage is god number one person is god god was the founder of marriage the bible says in the book of genesis chapter 2 verse 18 that god said it is not good for man to be alone i will make an apt meet for him so he was the one that instituted marriage it was his idea it was his plan it was his uh, establishment so it will take his wisdom and only his wisdom alone to be able to establish great marriage. So he is number one on the, on, the pyramid, on the pyramid if we are looking at the person that will help your marriage. That's why you have to apply the wisdom of God to run that marriage. You need to, to solicit the power of God to help in that marriage. You need to look for attention of God. To get the best out of your marriage so number one is god number two in that marriage is husband is the husband you as the husband please you need to learn to be the right husband the real husband and you that you marry husband you need to recognize him as the head as the leader as the father as the mentor in that house and submit to him number three is the wife the wife, the wife, that is the woman in that marriage. After God, the husband, after the husband, then the wife. You that you are married to a woman, you need to know how to nurture a woman, how to care for her. You need to protect her, you need to, to show her affection, you need to defend her. You don't force her to submit. When you love her, she will submit. And you that you are a wife, you need to know what your duties are to be the best wife anybody can marry. Number four, uh, children. Children are not really part of your marriage, but they are part of your family. Marriage involves only three people. The man, his wife, and their God, or their God, the man, and the wife. These are the three people that were standing on the altar the pastor or whosoever join you if you are a Christian, if it's a Christian wedding, represent God and and the husband was stand, the groom was standing, the, the bride was standing, and you were joined together in the name of the Lord. So marriage involved three. And three, these three people must be together running the marriage. But children will come. They will plug themselves into the marriage as part of the family. They can ruin the marriage if you don't handle them well. Especially women, wives that are watching this. Don't make your children the, the center of att attraction of your marriage. Don't think you are married to, that, to those children. They are not your husband. They are not your husband. They are your children. So please make each other the center of focus. And your children will be plugging around your family life. Children can be invaders. Children can be intruders. If you don't create boundaries and put them where they are, they can ruin your marriage for you and go out to go and get married. They will even blame you later for not building your marriage. So they are number four among those people that are very important in marriage. Number five are good mentors. Mentors are very, very important. Mentors are very, very important. You must have mentors that will help you. People that have run the race you want to run, please follow their path. People that have journeyed the path you want to travel. People that have evidence and good testimonies that you crave. Make them your mentors. Come around and learn from them. Read their books, attend their program, visit them at home and grow. Mentors are very, very important. If you want her to mentor you, just reach out to us. You can DM me in my Instagram account at BC at Diwali 
or facebook.com slash pastor bc adewale dm me we respond to you we give you the guideline how to be mentored then number six good friends good friends you need good friends around you husband and wife should be friends but you are you need some network of friendship you can't live in isolation who can you call if the ship is down you need to have good friends so if you have good friends they help to build your money but be very careful not to make virtual your friends not to make people that will ruin your marriage your friends so have good friends these are the six important people in your marriage and if you can handle them well you will have a solid viral sweeter and stronger marriage thank you for joining me in this video don't forget to follow me on our social media and bc adewale at bc adewale on instagram follow me now at bc adewale on twitter at bc adewale on youtube please subscribe to my youtube channel and put on the notification on tiktok is at bc dot adewale that's the only one that's bc dot adewale bc dot any other handle apart from this please ignore them apart the, apart from the one you are seeing on the screen then facebook is facebook.com slash pastor bc adewale these are my five handles follow us on this and so that you can enjoy these daily videos this video will be coming to you every day on youtube is by 6 a.m on instagram it will be coming at an, at another time join us and go and quickly get uh, i have a bonus for you don't forget to order for our books marriage super bundles Marry Super Bundles a set of four books that will turn your marriage and family life around forever. The first one is A Desperate Need of Your Wife, A Desperate Need of Your Husband, Five for That Marriage and 100% Marriage. These four books are what your marriage is looking for. Order for them now and they will, we are going to send them to you wherever you are. If you have these four books, I can assure you I can guarantee you, if you read them and practice what is in them, your marriage will be wow. Thank you for joining me. See you in another video.